Hello. Hello, Hello welcome to Let Me Tell You Sundays. Who's this? My name is Sam. Sam, welcome to the show. You're through to Spencer. We've got Earl Brown here. We're talking Black History Month. Your views, please. Well, my view is that Black History Month is um, patronizing and actually racist. Okay. And I'm actually thinking to myself, why isn't there a White History Month? Well, the, the argument would be that every other month is White History Month. Well, why is that? Because um, the, the white culture is the dominant culture in all our media, in, in the people that run our countries, and um, the, the white people are in a exactly. privileged there's, position. There's a, good, there's a good reason why. Would you like to tell me that reason, Sam? Well, the reason is because we are the pure race. Oh, right. And there's a reason why we have taken over other countries Which we, and assimilated though, ourselves. Are you a white man? Yes. Right. I'm 100% pure. Now, how do you know that? It's in my blood. I know it. Spencer, I know it to be true. I believe it to be true. This guy thinks it's he's undeniable. Right. And that... <laughs> Spencer, over to you. Uh, man, what, so please explain to me why you're the superior race. Because you were the first race on the planet. You do realize that, right? That is complete propaganda. I don't. You are that. not the first race on the planet. Yes, yes, where did, we are. Wait, 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 my, wait, 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 my friend, my friend. Where did, where did, where did the first civilization come from? Where did the first civilization come from? Texas. First civilization <laughs> of the Homo sapien. Where did they come from? And Texas. Homo sapien, my friend, Texas, we, right? we, means we're the we're smart created by Where God. did the first smart human come? From? We're created by God. No, but where did they come from? Where did God create them? In Eden. In Eden? Yes. Where is Eden? Eden is a place that God created. Okay. All right. Well, um, this is what I've got to say to you, brother. Until you can go deal with... We have to deal with facts. Wait, wait, wait. Let, let, let me get this straight. We, 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 we are not We are not brothers. In Eden. Where brothers. is Eden? You don't know. Where is it? <laughs> where is it? Yeah, where's Eden? Come on, come on. Geographically, where is it in the world? Let's have a conversation, not, not an argument, please. I'm not arguing. Not you. I'm talking to the other guy. All right, cool. Is it Sam? Sam am, am I being argumentative? No, no, no. no, no, no just no, don't talk no, over no, each other. Just don't talk over each other. Brother, I, well, I, 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 I can have a civil... Oh, brother, where, where did civilization first start from? Civilization first started, the only civilization, we're going by archaeological facts, which I spoke, came outside of Ethiopia 160,000 years ago. Ethiopia. People from Ethiopia do not look like you, pure white people. They don't look like you, brother. To this day, they still don't look like you. That's a fair point. Okay, then. <laughs> they were black, <laughs> one my one friend. One That's one what one. they were. And they were the first man who walked around, or the, the homo sapien that stands for the smart human who walked around on, 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 on two legs, right, was a black man. Look, I just believe that yeah, but your belief we would, we would, we would have been you better believe. off. You we have would to have come been... with facts. It's quite easy. You, you believe in your belief so much that that becomes a reality. I ain't arguing. That's your reality. But you have to come with facts. Your facts. I don't know. What are your facts? Tell me your facts. We would have been better off if we would just, if we would have just left that country alone. What country alone? Africa. Africa. If you left we, Africa alone. Left... But, you, but, but everyone comes from Africa. Africa. It's a scientific fact. So obviously, okay. I, just, I, just, I just don't agree with it. Alone, with. But then if you left it alone, you wouldn't be in existence. You I, come I mean, from you come from the loins of an African. That's where you come from. The so original man so was different? African. Why, these are not these are not my words. These are these, these are not my these are the words of white scientists. The pure race, as you call it. Are you serious? No, I'm telling you. <laughs> So you got Negro blood somewhere down in your lines. You know what I mean? I guarantee go to go to uh, uh, any um, genealogist. I don't think I can a, live with myself. They can take a swab was true. from, they I, can I take cannot, a swab from your from your saliva and they can tell you historically where you come from. Go and do it. It's an amazing thing. I've had it done. Go do it. Go check out where you're from. Where where would you suggest I do that? Where I go to go Google it. Go find out where, where what part of America are you from, sir? I'm from Texas in the South. All right, from Texas in the South. Well, go and go and go go to go go Google it. There must be somewhere a genealogical center in your in your area where you can put your historical facts from. They take a swap from you, and they, they from there they can determine from the DNA, 
and then from your DNA strandings, then you you can find out like where where your where your where your where your heritage is from and everything else. You might, because you might not like you have the to know this. Listen, one second. You're you're a Christian, right, brother? Yes, brother. Right, you're a Christian. So therefore, you being a Christian, mm-hmm. I say this to you. Now, Adam Adam was created from 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 dust. We got in Bible. We have to talk Bible now. Because, you know what I mean? I grew up in the church. So I know Bible. Even though I'm a Muslim now, but I grew up in the church. Now, well, Adam but brother, you, you betrayed the, the church. <laughs> oh, no. as, far as, I'm, as far as I'm concerned, you betrayed the church. I betrayed the church. Okay, oh, no. cool. All right, no problem. That's great. All right. High five. That's great. Anyway, moving on. Now, the Earth DNA, this is scientific fact, is 7.83. Now, we believe, well, you believe, because you're, you're a Christian, that you come from Adam. Yeah? <laughs> who, who, in, in Adam, if he came from the Earth, what color is the Earth, brother? Earth is all kinds of colors. No, 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 no. What color is the earth? Let's be real now. Come on. What color is the earth? What color is the earth? It's brown, like dirt. It's brown. Okay, then. So it's not your skin tone, right? Yes. What it's not your skin tone. What's the, what's the point? It's not white earth. It's brown earth. Most black people are not actually black. They're actually brown. You do realize that, right? You would agree with me there, Mr. B- Mr. Brown, right? Oh, uh, Brown, you bring yeah, you agree, right? Yeah, okay, yeah, right, I'm right. So therefore, I'm telling you this now. Brown, brown if you by name. Check, wait, wait, if you <laughs> to check the DNA stranding, the DNA stranding inside human beings, our frequency level is 7.83. This is facts. Now, the DNA level of the Earth's frequency is 7.83. Now, if you were to go and look at the universe, and you must know that the universe is 13.8 billion years old. 13.8. If, and this is not my, this is not this scientist telling us this. This is not me saying this. I'm telling you what scientists are telling us. Scientists are telling us this. This is how old the universe is. They're saying that the Earth within itself is, is 3.4 billion years old. They're saying the Earth is that. Of human life or human existence, we're only going back 160,000 years. So the earth in frequency of the human being, if we believe in Adam and Eve, I'm not saying that I don't believe in Adam and Eve, I'm saying it's because well, you're Christian, I just do with you and what you believe in. We are all connected and came from the earth. This is a fact that the first man on earth, because we're saying that he came from earth, this is what it says, that God created him from mud. We believe as Muslims, or as you as Christians say, he was created from, from the earth. The first form of racism was when God said to all the angels and all the living in existence or the beings to bow down to Adam. And what happened? Satan, the devil, said, no, I'm not, I'm not bowing down to him. Why? Because I'm made from smokeless fire and I'm higher than he is and he's, he's, come, he's come after me. That was the first form of racism if you're a Christian. Sam, put that in your pipe and smoke it. But, uh, wow. Thanks for uh, getting I'm, in touch. I'm, I'm speechless. I'm, I'm out of here. Good man. I'm sorry. I, I, can't, <laughs> I can't listen to this. Appreciate your call. Thank you very much. There he goes. The first don't call. try to bring no... This one time. Don't try to bring no foolishness to me. I'm not... People call me the noise. I'm not, I don't just know. I ain't got noise just on blocks. Even though I'm a vicious historian, everyone knows this. Fantastic. Don't try to bring them foolish talk to me. Like I'm saying to you. You know what I mean? God created all of us if you believe in that, right? But if God created all of us, then know this part here. The things what we argue and fight about, we should be arguing what, what are the things, or we should not be arguing, but we should be agreeing on the things that we agree on. Well, Instead of looking on the things to argue about, I ain't got time for this nonsense. I can't believe that this guy actually phoned in to talk rubbish. Yes, I'm a Christian, sir, and blah, 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 and all the rest of it. Okay, then cool. If you are a Christian, <laughs> this guy who just got off the phone, because I know he'll still be listening. If you are a Christian, that means that you are meant to be Christ-like. 